Hey everyone, uh, this is Finding Value. Uh, I wanna go over a little presentation. It's uh, on a lot of materials or metals that are gonna see supply uh, gaps or deficits coming up very, very soon. Uh, this is definitely the beginning of a commodities bull market. Uh, and if they're holding rates low and printing a bunch of money and trying to get inflation, that is fuel to the fire for this commodities boom. This could be some of the biggest commodity boom that we've ever seen in our lives and probably in anyone's life because these supply gaps are so large, so quick that we're going to have to really ramp up production. Uh, and and I, th I think prices, since production can't be ramped up very quickly, prices are going to go very high. I'm going to jump into some of these metals. You'll lose me for the video, but uh, let's, let's go over this. It's pretty interesting stuff. So this is the copper supply demand. This is 2020 right here. So there's already a growing gap. It's opening up. So we got to take our positions in copper companies. I mean, this is, this is going to get big. And, and four to six million tons in a market at this point right here is only a, a, a 17 you know, million pound market or million ton market, I mean. Next, zinc. Look at the zinc balance. Here we're in 2020. This thing's grown large. So zinc, existing production and improved projects. So we've got a, a shortage in zinc. Uh, this one's nickel. Again, 2020 is right in this little gap here. It grows very large, very quick. I'd say that the, the 22, 23 inventory overhang worked off by 2023, new supply needed. So that's coming very quick for nickel. Uh, this one's cobalt. Supply, and look at this demand. Here's 2020, it's already just starting to outstrip. So cobalt, a definite opportunity here. Global silver supply. We've been running deficits and eating our inven into inventories the entire time here. Uh, it's going to come very soon where the inventory runs dry, and I think it's 2020 where it runs dry. We've got demand, we've got production, we've got a large gap, very large gap. 750 million ounces versus, oh, that's in tons, 750 tons or whatever. Deficits coming for silver. Palladium. Deficits. That's why the price is so high. Deficit year after year after year. Rhodium. Deficits. Massive deficits. Lots higher prices coming. Here's platinum. Now this is just for fuel cell. This is just fuel cell demand, okay? Just fuel cell. 2020, very high for fuel cell demand coming up. So somewhere in this general vicinity between 2020 and 2030, we are going to exceed all of production for just fuel cells of current production. This right here is, is 12 million ounces. We only make, we only produce 6 million ounces a year. This is, this is going to be ridiculous trying to do this stuff. Just ridiculous. Prices are going to go so much higher. This is uranium. 2020, here comes the gap. Remember, this is inelastic demand. I mean, it, prices have to go... They're going to go soaring higher, but just a huge gap. So much opportunity for investment here. This one's lithium. Uh, lithium, you can see the, the demand really taken off, and here's the processed output. Big gaps coming, 2023 and on. So what I want to talk about here is, there's, this, is this is right at the beginning of a commodities boom. We have so many supply gaps that have to be filled. Prices are going to go so much higher than where they are today. We've got COVID and all of these, a lot of these companies are still way down. We need to accumulate. We need to load up with whatever we can in all of these mining companies now. Now, a year, depends on what it is. I mean, copper is a great opportunity. Nickel, a great opportunity. All these, silver, gold, great opportunities to get invested, stay long, find your companies, look for a portfolio. Let's Maybe I'll go over a clip on portfolio and how we should be managing this. Uh, another one that I didn't go over, uh, oil and, and natural gas. I mean, there's so many opportunities out there. Uh, you'll see another couple of clips. If you like these videos, please subscribe, comment, rate them, uh, and I appreciate your time, guys. This is Finding Value.